Hello, extremely unpopular YouTube vlogger, Fames Jurgensen here, doing another EMF video. So this one's gonna be about how to Faraday cage your Wi-Fi with household materials, i.e. aluminum foil. So aluminum foil will cut the signal, as you'll see, um, pretty drastically. The problem is that like the, the fan doesn't work, so like it's not exhausting anything, so the Wi-Fi will probably be like overheat and uh, then something bad will happen when the thing overheats, most likely. It hasn't happened yet. I've had it wrapped up for like a week. Anyway, so you can see my Wi-Fi is disabled. I got the other one disabled too. Maybe let's prove that. So this is the, the five gigahertz one. That's the larger one. Where is that? See my network name. I knew about the EMF, but I didn't know that I still got blasted even if the Wi-Fi was off. See, that one's disabled too, that's the weaker one. And yeah, I'm still getting blasted by that thing over there. All right, so I'm gonna go buy it. I'm gonna wrap it up with tin foil. We'll see how it cuts the signal. All right, so I'm here, I'm maxing out. I'm being seriously poisoned with EMF right now. I just got some tin foil wrap. I'm gonna wrap this sucker up. Forget how I had it. See, I'm in my boxer shorts here. It's professional. My life is a professional vlogger. Making videos in my underpants. So I got this sucker wrapped up in tin foil now. But again, it's not good because it can't exhaust. But so now I'm right next to it, I'm not even maxing out. It's at two or three. Right next to it. Back up a few feet. And I'm at one, five something. Back up even more. See, distance is your friend when it comes to EMF. Now I'm on the couch. Way better at 0.45 or so. And it's about, I don't know, eight, eight feet away or so. Wrapped up in tin foil. <laughs> Looking real classy on the TV stand. But yeah, it's better than, what was it, better than a two. So it's that cut almost in, cut by five. Divide by five, we get a little further away. I'm at a 0.22, which is not that bad. I just have Simone sit over there when we watch TV. All right. Well, then another trick you I do. So I'm gonna move this sucker to the corner. There's, there I am in my underwear again. I just don't try anymore. You should start making videos in your underwear. It's like giving up. Okay, so now it's in the corner. Tripping over shit. And what's this? Is that even better? 
move over to the other corner. Yeah, that's better. So before it was like at 20 over here, now it's at 0 0.09, 0 0.08, which is pretty low on the meter. It's almost green. So I'm still getting kind of high rate, or slightly elevated radiation levels with the Wi-Fi and tinfoil in the corner of the room. Without any ventilation, that thing is a ticking time bomb, probably. Probably gonna burn the house down. But, but, on the bright side, I have lowered my radio frequency EMF levels in the house. But yeah, not bad for just, if you have some foil to wrap that sucker up and then you use ethernet cables to do your internet. So way better option than having your Wi-Fi on because right here I'd be blasted with like a one or a two, one point, like a two point something if the Wi-Fi were on. That's not so bad. This is livable. Anywho, thanks for watching, guys. Good luck with your EMF mitigation journey. Okay, bye-bye.